everybody, I'm Chef AJ and welcome to Weight Loss Wednesday. I'm the creator of the Ultimate Weight Loss Program and the author of the book, The Secrets to Ultimate Weight Loss. And this is where I show you recipes for healthy, permanent, and sustainable weight loss. I got an email from Lexi who says she's really struggling to go plant-based because of one thing honey mustard dressing. And she said, can I create one that's vegan? And I said, sure. Well, obviously you don't use honey because it's not vegan, but even if I wouldn't use it anyway, because I'm SOFAS free, S-O-F-A-S, -S, sugar, oil, flour, alcohol, salt. I follow a plant exclusive diet as I've done for 42 years. So I wouldn't want to use anything like agave or maple syrup or anything like that. So what do we use when we're doing whole food plant-based, SOFAS free? dates. So here is my version of a honey mustard dressing and I'm going to make it really thick because I like using it actually as a dip for vegetables. So what I'm starting with is 12 ounces of cauliflower. You buy them in a bag at the freezer section and the refrigerated section or you can just buy the head and measure out 12 ounces. And then I just cooked it in this little cute little Pampered Chef micro steamer for six minutes so that the cauliflower got nice and soft and then I chilled it because I want my dressing cold. So I'm gonna, I drained the water by the way, there might be just a little bit left, but I put in all 12 ounces of the cooked cauliflower. And to that I am adding four ounces of pitted dates and I only put enough water over the top just so that they would be nice and soft and it would blend easily. And then one half cup of mustard. And the mustard that I am using is the salt-free West Gray mustard, which you can get at many natural food stores and on Amazon and places like that. So now I'm going to blend all the ingredients together. honey mustard dressing. Now, make this recipe according to your preference. If you think this is too mustardy, cut back on the mustard. If you think it's too sweet, cut back on the dates. So what I like to do, believe it or not, a long time ago, I was a pampered chef consultant and they taught us really cool things like how to use this tool. So for a really pretty presentation, it's really fun if you take colored bell peppers, this is a red one, but I also have an orange and a yellow, which I've cut up. And like, let's say you're doing a plant-based barbecue where you've got some bean burgers maybe on the grill. What you can do is this can be the condiment holder. So for the red bell pepper, you put your ketchup and I have two sofas free ketchup recipes in my book. For the yellow bell pepper, you put the mustard. And if you have a green bell pepper, maybe you put relish in it what you'd put in the orange one but to make a really pretty presentation also always make sure that it sits up straight if it doesn't just cut a little bit off the bottom but you can make this really really pretty presentation by taking this tool and making these little V shapes throughout I have not done this in many many years so I'm probably taking a little bit too much off the top I probably should have practiced but I hate wasting vegetables well it wouldn't be waste because I could always eat them Put them in a soup. Okay, so you go all the way around. And then when you take it off, you've kind of got this real pretty look to it. And then of course you want to clean out the membrane so that you can put your stuff in. And I really did not do this as good as you could. I should have gone a little bit higher up. But you want to clean this out so that you have a nice surface for your dip. And then I have here a plate already with cut up yellow and red bell peppers. You can use anything. And of course, I, I won't waste this. I'll show you how to use this. And then I'm going to take my beautiful honey mustard dip and put it in my bell pepper. And then kids will love this because kids love things that they can dip. And you can see how beautiful the color is. And I could even put this back on top if I wanted to. By the way, I, my, I don't know if you noticed my t-shirt, it's from the podcast Switch for Good. Alexandra and Dotsie gave it to me when I was a guest. I really recommend that podcast. And I really recommend this recipe because any way that you can get vegetables in is gonna be a good thing. So there you have it. Thank you for your question, Lexi. A vegan, cruelty-free, sugar-free, honey, mustard, but it's not really honey, but it is really mustard, 
dressing or dip. Enjoy, I'm Chef AJ, and I truly believe you can have both the health and the body you so richly deserve. Bye now.